in this lecture we will see about the offset command so let's see that how we can use that so offset command is here in the modifier tool you can see that this one is the offset command in the shortcut for this is OF so you can just simply select on that and if you take your mouse cursor uh, you can see that this one is getting highlighted so basically if you notice here carefully you can see that my mouse cursor is on the upper side and if you take your mouse cursor to the downside you can see the same thing here is that uh, it, you are getting a uh, some kind of uh, dotted line which shows that where that wall will model okay so I will take my mouse cursor on the upper side on the upper hand side on the upper side you can see that this one is dotted and if you do a single click you can just replicate this you can see that I, I have just replicated this in just with the help of single click so here you have to uh, make sure that of these things as well so right now you can see that this one is numerical and we have just a uh, put a uh, some value here so you can see that you can actually change this value as well you can make this one 2 meter 3 meter or even 4 meter you can use any value here so what you can do is so you can just simply put uh, let's say 5 here for example let me just in simply put 5 and again I can take my mouse cursor to this region you can see where that wall will model so you can just simply do a single click and the wall will model here now uh, let's look about uh, this copy option so you can see that right now the copy command is activated it means that if you're going to do the uh, offset uh, the original uh, the, the original object will leave but if you just untick that one the original object will get deleted so let me show you I can just simply select on that you can see that this one is deleted and let me show you that so you can see with the help of copy it will actually offset that thing and it will also create uh, it will also create a copy of that thing so you can see the original will will also stay here and uh, you will get a copy of that offset as well so we have seen about offset we have seen about the copy we have seen about the numerical as well now it's time for the graphical so in graphical what you can do is you can if you just simply select on that the, uh, these offset will not be available here because in that case you have to just simply select and then drag and in that case only you will uh, it will get offset you can see here you can see graphically all these things graphically all you need is just to do a single click and then from where you want to copy that so for, for example let's say I want to offset that thing from this point then from this point actually it will offset that thing and from here uh, you can see you can actually input the number as well so right now you can see that this one is a 1.4 meter or you can just simply put 2 here and you can see that it has been offsetted by 2 meters and uh, you already know what is the use of copy so let me just simply select on that and let me use the graphical one you can see I've just selected on that and then I want to offset this one from this I can just do a single click as well or what I can do is I can just again clicking on this one and from here I can actually enter any value as well so this is all about the offset command